okay up everyone uh, I'm doing this really quickly uh, and Aiden made a post of the video uh, I'm gonna react to it right now what the fuck no problem in the top of the world is that his voice Dad, the way they should be what the fuck all of a sudden some strange things are happening what the fuck you have power you have respect oh my god not anymore what's he saying the love of your jokes you think you're doing quite well but you don't think what the fuck when you turn it back you hit it all by yourself what the fuck gone who is this He's talking to someone. What the fuck? Uh, Jesus Christ, what the fuck? What's he saying? It's hard to hear his voice. Uh, what are these noises? What the? Huh? What? This is confusing. This is confusing. What do you think voice you've got there, Shadow Man? Jesus Christ! <laughs> okay! Okay, I can't theorize right now. I'm, on, I'm currently doing something else right now, so I can't theorize right now, but I'll do it later. Oh my god. Oh my god. Two days later. Hey up, everyone. So, uh, two days ago, uh, there was an audio file that Anaden tweeted about. And uh, you would have just seen my reaction just now. And uh, so, first off, the bug has deleted it. But now we have the spectrogram of said audio file. And also, by the way, the audio file itself was a was like a corrupted version of like the of like a Toy Story song. I think it was called Stranger Things. Strange Things. It's something like that. It's a corrupted version of that song. And uh, the spectrogram is where the real stuff is. Uh, here's our first image I'll be presenting. Yeah. That's his eyeballs again. Those are his squiggly eyes. Which means that this doesn't really mean much. This is just his eyes. But this instantly means that, uh, yeah, this spectrogram is something. Like, Jesus Christ. SMG4's doing an ARG now. Huh. Huh. And remember, remember what Anaden said. He said that he didn't, he hasn't gone that far yet. I think that yet has arrived. Because now, he's going into the spectrogram of things. Eee! Okay, so here is our next image. And, uh, looking over here, it seems that there's something. I think I can maybe deduce a face around here. That might be looking like an eye and that looks like a mouth. But, uh, I don't know, it doesn't look like anything. Well, at least I can't see anything. Uh, this seems like a hippo's mouth. And this right here, this looks like some kind of box of some kind. I'm not entirely sure what it is, but I feel like I can see it. And over here, this is what Steve M pointed out. He, he pointed out that this kind of looks like a TV. From an angle. Which. TVs. Come on. We all know what that means. When it comes to fucking TVs. We all know. Come on. It's Mr. Puzzles. Obviously. The TV man himself. Oh. God damn it. So yeah. Well at least it looks like a TV. It very much looks like it. We've got the edges. The squares. The edges. And like the black screen. And what looks to be a few antennas around there. So, yeah, we have a TV screen there. Then we have our next image, which is the word stuck. Uh, spammed a lot to the very end of the pen of the spectrogram. 
So he's spamming stuck, 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 stuck. Meaning that, that is quite interesting. It means that the Shadow Man's trapped in some way. What's he trapped in? The prison cell? Is he trapped in the prison cell? I mean, because that's where he last was seen in What V 2023, but that was during What V 2023. It's been quite a while since, so it's most likely not the prison that he's stuck in. But what he's more likely to be stuck in is the SMG4 universe. Because where else would he be? Or is he trapped in a body? Perhaps? I think it's either that he's just, him himself is just stuck in the SMG4 universe. And we'll get on to why I think of that a bit later on. But it's certainly certified that he's trapped here. And then we have our next image, which is uh, very, very hard to read. Like, seriously, who can read that? Well, I can. And, oh, sort of, I don't know what the hell's being said there, and I think something's being said there. The word, help? Help? I think the word help's popping up in there, but, so, uh, so, yeah, right there. It seems like the word help is being put there, but, uh, there's a bunch of circles over there, but I think it's just from the spectrogram itself. And, uh, here we, the words I can deduce is escape and hellhole. Hell hole. He's in a hell hole. So I don't know what kind of hole he's in, but well, hell hole's like a you know description for something that's hellish or just very awful. So again, that's going into the idea that he's trapped in the SMG4 universe somehow. And it seems like it says fuse there, fuse, fube, uh, oob, something. Don't know, I can't really read this bit here. But all I can know is that he wants to... He seems to be wanting to escape from the hellhole that is most likely the SMG4 universe. So, ooh, probably cut myself off just then, but looking here... Okay, come on, that just gives it away. Mr. Puzzles is involved in this. Which is really interesting. So Mr. Puzzles being involved with this gives off a few implications. One of those implications is that this is Mr. Puzzles is doing? Perhaps Mr. Puzzles trapped the Shadow Man here? Or the Shadow Man, this message, is directly talking to him, Mr. Puzzles. Why? Because from what we see later on, he seems to be, it just seems to be that Shadow Man is talking to Mr. Puzzles specifically. Or us, the viewers, which Honestly, makes more sense, because we're the ones that are diving into the spectrogram, after all. And, uh, yeah, uh, this man right here has some involvement. Definitely, probably, do, due to being, you know, what, for 2023, there's, you know, it's, it's very obvious that he's gonna be in, that Mr. Puzzle's gonna be what, for, and possibly the Shadow Man might be, like, a, like, a, a cat, that he might pop in, like, at the end of the what, for, Maybe, maybe, I'm not sure, because uh, this is something that never happens in SMG4. We've never seen an ARG like this before. So, yeah, mmm, mmm, mm. I don't know <laughs> what Mr. Puzzles has got to do with all of this. Maybe, yeah, once again, I, I don't know, I, I I'll have to look into that more at some point. But what, all I can deduce is that the Shadow Man might be talking to Mr. Puzzles. This might be this, this entire message might be towards him, or it's towards us. And uh, Mr. Puzzles is uh, definitely got some involvement. Maybe he trapped the Shadow Man. Who knows? Who knows? Then we have our next image, which is, you know, more readable. Filthy eyes watching everywhere. Think that's definitely towards us. First off, the bug is calling us filthy. That's just straight up rude. And uh, second off... He's definitely talking about how, like, you know, he's, a uh, how, like, he's, he's definitely annoyed and aware that we are watching him. Most certainly. Because, well, this just gives it away, obviously. And he doesn't like it. As can obviously be told. But why doesn't he? Well, maybe because he's trying to be a secret character. He has been secret. He's always been a secret character. 
Hell, he's always been able to be right under our noses all the damn time. However, ever since we started looking into it, and when Anaiden obviously gave it the way that he's around, and that, you know, obviously we started hunting, we started finding him in places, now he's obviously aware, he's gained awareness that we're watching him, which is, obviously, this is obviously starting to become a, a, a direct message to the audience, because, yeah. Then here's our next image, which has his eyes appear again. This bugger's clearly really likes watching us a lot. He's, we're watching him and he's watching us. And he says this, you are not supposed to be here. Which is obviously him probably saying that, you know, he's meant to be a secret character. He's meant to be a secret that's not meant to be found. But then we found him and now he ain't very happy about it. So him saying that we're not supposed to be here, perhaps there's like a consequence to us finding him? Perhaps, I feel like this Watford could have gone either way. If we never found the Shadow Man, or like if Anita never said anything about him, then the Watford might end differently, you know? It might, it, it might have just ended differently because like we never found the Shadow Man, but now that we have, we are very, we're, it's very likely now that we might face the consequence of that. What is that consequence? I don't know, but actually I do know because I know what the rest of the images are, so yeah, 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 so it's very clear that the Shadow Man does not want want us here and we're probably going to face the consequence of finding him. Moving on. Here is our next image. He says that I got what I came for. Time to get out of here with his two beady eyes again. Now, this is quite interesting. He says he's already got what he came here for. So it's definitely, it's definitely that he's arrived to the SMG4 universe, did a thing, and then he's now left. What that thing is, is unknown to me. Or, there's two things. One, is that I have a feeling. I've just had a feeling that just clicked into my head just now, actually. What if the Shadow Man gave Mr. Puzzles his head? His TV head. Because, and perhaps that TV, the TV that he gave to Mr. Puzzles when he was about to chop off his own head, is what gave him his power. Because Mr. Puzzles, like, where did his powers come from? Where did his powers from his TV and all of that come from? Maybe the Shadow Man's our answer. Maybe he is our answer. Because perhaps... Given the way that the Shadow Man can seemingly do quite a few similar things to, you know, what Mr. Puzzles can break in the fourth wall and that, and that Mr. Puzzles is involved in, in, in the Shadow Man's scheming that, or whatever he's doing, it's, there's a chance that he's probably responsible for why Mr. Puzzles has his TV head, and how it's able to do the stuff it can do. And now he's gonna try and get out of here. But th there's also another thing, that the picture that he took of Mary of Maggie and Terry in that Western Spaghetti scene that we've discussed before, perhaps that photo was what he was after, which is a bit weird, it's more weirder and doesn't make as much sense, why would you just want to take a single photo and why would you be constantly stalking for just a photo, why, 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 what would you do with that, admire it or something like that, it wouldn't make that much sense, but the other one, the TV whole thing that I mentioned, I think that one might be what he did, and what he came for. Now this image, now this image right here, uh, this one's really hard to read, but after looking at it enough, I think I've got, I think I've deduced, oh, I think I've deduced what it's saying. Go, I think this is, I, I can't really tell what this says, at all, I mean that's a huh, that's a huh with a question mark, and it says, Go get, I think that's saying go get, get something, but I can't read these, I don't know what they say, but I know what this entire thing says here, expecting, expecting some story to be told for the future, you would like that, would you, I think that says that, I'm pretty sure, which is interesting. Because he seems to know what we are like, us theorists. This feels like a direct message towards us, the theorists. 
people like Steve M, me, and many others who are looking into this. He knows what we what we're doing this for. He knows very damn well, and it's for a story, and for a future. And the next image directly talk addresses this. No, you ain't getting anything from me. With those two baby eyes again. He doesn't want us to know anything. Because you kind of know that. We all know now that he's got law re relevance. But he's not willing to give us it. Which, okay. You want to do it the hard way? But, okay, jokes aside. This is interesting. He is persistent in not telling us anything. He's hiding something. I know it, you cheeky motherfucker. I know that this bugger is hiding something. But, unfortunately, I can't really tell. Aside from what my assumptions are. But, he's not gonna willingly get it. Give us it. I feel like we're gonna need someone else to get it us. Get it themselves, which... Us fierce. we're gonna try and get the law ourselves. We're gonna... We're gonna do, we're gonna do, you do not understand the persistence and insanity we go through, Shadow Man. You don't understand it, we will find that damn law. But on the contrary, he also says this. But I can take something from you. He's gonna take something from us, and the next image is this. It's an image. Those look like eyes, and that is a hand. He is reaching out to us and is gonna take something from us. What that is, I don't fucking know. But yeah, this is he this this boy ain't breaking the fourth wall. He's fucking shattering it. He's shattering the fourth wall by reaching out to us and taking something from us. Also, by the way, Shadow Man hand reveal. I guess. It's got such long fingers. What's it with original SMG4 villains and their long ass fingers? Mr. Puzzles and the Shadow Man. What's with their long ass fingers, my guy? No, I shouldn't be talking about the fingers. I should be talking about the fact that he's literally going to yoink something on us. What is that? Our eyes? Our brain cells? I mean, he obviously can't do that physically, but. He's going to do something, but what he's going to take, we don't know. Because this is the final image. This is the last image. There's nothing left. There's nothing left of this, of this spectrogram. That is literally it. It ends with him reaching out to us to try and take something from us. And unfortunately, I don't know what that is. This definitely has something to do with Waffy. There, there's also some ideas that we can do. Maybe he's going to take a character from us, an SMG4 character from us, by killing him. Just try to kill him. Just try to, just offing him. Just like that. Who would that be? I'm not sure. Or, he's going to do what Mr. Puzzles is hoping to do. To transform the SMG4 show into his own. Perhaps, yeah, perhaps they're going to steal the show. Perhaps the Shadow Man's going to steal the show from us. But, this is a direct message to us, the theorists, however, so, what's he gonna take? I don't know, I don't know what he's gonna take, don't ask me, I don't know, I don't know what this bugger right here is gonna steal from us, but all we know is that he's gonna try and take something from us, he doesn't want us to give us any law, and he's gonna try and take something from us instead, and Mr. Puzzles is involved, and all of that, so, that's what this spectrogram is, and, um, yeah, that's, all I've got, that's all I've got. We'll have to theorize this more in depth later on when Anaiden gives us more hints or when tomorrow's episode possibly shows something. Who knows? And that's all I've got. Ta-ta.